So I've been counseling Babita for a long time. She's been drinking, smoking, and not taking care of her bone quality. So she recently fell down and she broke her hip. Can she actually sit cross-legged like this after the surgery? That's what she asked me. For sitting cross-legged, I hope Babita won't mind if I just expose her hip joint a little bit. So this is the movement at the hip joint, which is external rotation. Movement at the knee joint and movement at the ankle to get into a cross leg position. So it is not only about your hip, it's also about the flexibility of your knee and your ankle. You have to have good flexibility at the hip joint, knee joint and ankle joint to be able to sit cross-legged. Generally after hip replacement surgery, if it has been done well, then we do not restrict our patients from going into that position. And also after the knee injury, if your rehabilitation program has been started well in time, we are able to achieve good range of motion good flexibility and cross-leg sitting. And for more such useful content and to meet Babita, follow me on Dr. Pankajwale's official.